I get this question a lot. I, it's like an every other day question, emails, comments. So I thought I would address it because there's not a whole lot of videos on it. And there's not a whole lot of information. It's just mixed reviews. And at the end of the day, after you're reading forums and watching videos, you're confused and you don't know what the word zinc means for your Jeep 4.0. So today we're going to be talking about the Jeep 4.0 only. Um, now this works for older motors too. Now the 4.0 was designed with a push rod design and a flat tappet uh, lifter and the cam goes around and hits the flat tap and it goes up and blah blah blah. You can look all that stuff up. Now, so basically you got a cam lobe that's going around and hitting a flat piece on the bottom of the, the lifter, right? So there's no roller there, it's the cam just rubbing against a flat piece of metal. There's friction there. As the years go on, they make new oil and synthetic oil and how it's supposed to be so great for your car and you can run it for a whole year. And people run this stuff in their Jeep 4 and after a while their cam actually eats itself, right? So the cam lobes get wore off. Now the outside of a cam is very hard, but once you wear that metal off the outside, the inside is very soft. Now I've seen a couple 4 O's, um, eat some cams due to the newer oil that people are using. There's not a whole lot of benefits from running the new age oil in our old 4.0s. And you're probably saying, you know, what what should I run? What 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 should I run? What do you run in your Jeep 4.0? So I've been running Rotella forever in old Fords, old Jeeps. I've been running that because it has high levels of zinc. They did redo the oil i think it was like in 2016 2017 and people were losing their minds but if you look in the description i have an email conversation um, of the zinc levels in the t4 rotella that i use now they have different weights but i use the 1540 i've not had a problem here in west virginia with the, the cold or anything but that's the oil that i use because you know my jeep has 200 and some thousand miles on it so 1540 will do just fine um, there's a whole lot more information in the description below so you can read up on that. Now a lot of people say why don't you just get the additives. I'm not a big fan of going out there screwing around with the oil or taking a quart of oil out and adding the zinc additive. Um, a lot of people are like oh I used to run STP because it has zinc in it. And it even says right on the front of the STP bottle, the STP treatment, the oil treatment bottle, it has zinc in it. But if you actually do your research. I have that also in the description below that it has very very low amounts of zinc in the oil so the reason why you want to run zinc in your oil just to make a long story short there's a lot more protection um, it puts a barrier between the two pieces of metal and when that cam comes around and hits that flat tapped uh, lifter it puts a barrier there and it keeps everything lubed up nice now the newer oil I believe I think, I mean, I'm not a oil professional, does not do that, and that's why it's eating cams. Um, now, for your newer cars nowadays, yeah, that's all totally fine, but if you're running an older vehicle with a push rod system, I recommend running something with high levels of zinc. And the only way to do that is get Rotella. And there's another oil out there that has a little bit uh, of levels of zinc in it, but um, I'm just telling you what I run that way. I already know and I'm comfortable with it. I already know what it's going to do to your engine. I've had five or six four O's and I've run Rotella in it and I've not had not one problem. A lot of people say, oh, if you run Rotella, it's going to clog up your Cadillac converter. I've not had that problem on the Jeep. Yes, I can see it. It will happen, but I've not had that problem on the Jeep. Uh, heck, people even run Rotella oil in razors and dirt bikes. So I wouldn't freak out too much about it. I would just pick your favorite weight of Rotella that you're gonna run or give it a try. I mean, it couldn't hurt anything and you could go back to your oil. But once you run Rotella, I think you'll enjoy running Rotella because it has high heat levels and it's just it's just the best oil to run in your Jeep 4.0. I'm Cherokee Ronnie. Stay dirty, my friends.